My name is Sarah Grimke. I live from November 26, 1792 to December 23, 1873. I lived in South Carolina, Massachusetts, and traveled a lot throughout New England as I preached about equality. I was an abolitionist and a feminist. I am grateful for my voice. Three things I can't live without are fighting for my rights, my voice, and my integrity. My favorite newspaper is The Liberator. One thing that makes me happy is freedom and equality. One thing that makes me sad is hatred. I work towards attaining equality for all. I stand for equality for all, no matter sex, race, religion, or creed. I stand against racism, discrimination, prejudice, and injustice. I have overcome adversity against all odds. My favorite quote is, Hitherto she has surrendered her person and individuality to man. But she can no longer do this and not feel that she's outraging her nature and her God. I would like to be remembered as a woman who sought rights for myself and all others discriminated against. I would like to donate to Equality Now, which is a charity for women and children, and the Southern Poverty Law Center, which is a charity for anyone being discriminated against. My name is Barbara Laner. I was born on December 19, 1995 in Louisville, Kentucky, and have lived here ever since. I am a daughter, a sister, a friend, a dreamer, an athlete, a writer, a student, a teacher, and an individual. I work towards a better life for myself and others. I stand for my freedom and my country. I stand against hate and prejudice. I have overcome the past. I am grateful for my family and my friends. My favorite book is Sarah's Keep. My favorite movies are Elf and Father of the Bride. My favorite music is country, alternative, rock, and pop. Three things I can't live without are my family, my friends, and my life. One thing that makes me sad is thinking about what was and what if. One thing that makes me happy is music. My favorite quote is, Do not take life too seriously. You will never get out alive. By El Elbert Hubbard. Um, I would like to be remembered as someone who lit lives life enthusiastically and positively. I would like to donate to two charities. First, the Special Olympics, which helps dis mentally disabled children to participate in group activities and sports, which they might otherwise not have the opportunity to participate in. And the second is Camp Aaron, a camp for kids who have recently lo lost loved ones in their life. I was here.